A search and destroy mission today for a fish. And this is no typical fish. It's called snakehead. It can survive on land for days. And Channel 2's Baron Peterson, live along Lake Lanier, where DNR is warning anglers who catch one of these, kill it. Do not throw it back. Well, DNR doesn't want to reveal where they found these fish. Not the exact location. It was in Gwinnett County. So we came out here to Lake Lanier to talk to local anglers. There were a lot of them out here earlier. Most of them had already heard about this. Now, DNR's found four of them. And they're making very clear what you're supposed to do if you catch one. When you run a bait and tackle shop, you hear every big fish story. Tim Hawkins wishes this one wasn't true. But if somebody's actually catching one on a, on a lure or just fishing, that could be a problem. The habitat that's really ideal um, for a species like a snakehead to, to take hold. In a marshy corner of Gwinnett County, some Georgia DNR biologists are hunting a fish that can breathe air and live on land for up to four days. Well, this is the first time that we've documented them being in Georgia. Last Friday, a local angler hooked what's called a northern snakehead. It's native to Asia and Africa and can turn our local ecosystems upside down. Experts say the fish can reach three feet in length and would be at the top of the food chain. DNR's Hunter Roop says if you hook one, don't throw it back. We would ask any anglers um, that, that do catch a snakehead, that may catch one, um, to kill it immediately and, and call DNR and report it so that we can document when and where. Tim Hawkins worries about what could happen if snakeheads were let loose in Georgia's lakes, rivers, and streams. They would be competing amongst all the striper, all the spotted bass, all the catfish. So it wouldn't, it wouldn't be very good, no. And DNR's thinking that these snakeheads may have come from somebody's aquarium who just dumped the whole contents in that pond in Gwinnett County. Point live along Lake Lanier, Barrett Peterson, Channel 2 Action News.